Listen, come on! Listen to me, damn it! Dumber, listen to me! Let's celebrate. What are we celebrating? Our last mission. I've heard that before. This is the one. By the end of the day, all of us are gonna be fucking rich, but mostly you and me. It's another wreck. It's not just any wreck. The UNN Urshinabi. Dropped off the map less than a week ago. No distress call. Those UNN pricks never come out this far unless they're carrying something special. Aren't you one of those UNN pricks? <laughs> Easy. If I'm still one of those UNN pricks, then you're still an OPA traitor with Anderson Dawes bounty on your head. But... The past is the past. The past is the past. Why didn't you take it? The bounty. I knew you were worth more. Anybody who could piss off someone that dangerous must be pretty fucking valuable. Anderson Dawes is a gangster and a killer. It's not hard to piss off a man like that. Well, his loss is my gain. Just want to make sure you're not having second thoughts about our deal. No, come on. We're equal partners. We pay the crew, the costs, and the overhead. The rest is 50-50. You and me. We've got a good thing going here. Nobody fucks with you, which means nobody fucks with me. And hell, if this score is what I think it could be, you've got the deal of the century. Now drink. Yam yeah, Sang, or whatever the fuck you people say. Close enough. Time to rally the crew for Cox's latest, last mission. I should start by briefing Cox. Khan, new orders from the captain. I know. He already sent me the coordinates. Captain thinks that this could be- Last score we'll ever need. All of a century. I got the pep talk from him. What's our ETA? It depends. On what? On how long you plan to waste my time. Oh dear. I made the lackey upset. Forgive me.
Fashang Fong. You will bet. I'll back to to you eventually. You want to braid somebody's hair? Go find Maya. I'm busy. We're nearly there. The debris field is massive. It'll take me a minute to navigate. Somebody blew that ship to hell and back. I should check the command console for more information on the Oshinabi. As the XO, it's my job to make sure the ship and his crew are in order. I keep a log on the ship and on our scavenge missions. Haven't had to shoot much, but we keep the PDCs fully stocked. Just in case. Wouldn't want to do a high G burn in one of these. It's bad enough with the juice and the cushy chair. Time to find the rest of the crew. Arlen said he put all this away. What was it, three days ago? Lazy Gemini. Ship's diagnostics always come back good. The Artemis isn't much to look at, but she's built to last. Virgil. Virgil! <sighs> Exo drummer. <clears throat> Usually medics only know enough to plug that thing in and rig up the morphine dispenser. Well, I took a course in autodoc repair during my residency. Useful for work outside the medical system. It's been giving me abnormal readings since series, but I finally know why. The laser crystal's badly occluded. This looks like the kind of job that Maya would kill for. While Miss Castillo can no doubt install a new crystal, I'm afraid we'll need a new one first. I can only imagine what ancient welding equipment the captain dug this stone out of. But we'll need a high-quality gem for surgical work. I assume you didn't come here to talk about crystals. We have a new target. What is it this time, El Dorado? The Fountain of Youth? Let me guess. The Falcon Horde of Venus? <laughs> the UNN Urshanabi. Cap believes there's something valuable on board. Something special. Do we want to invite that kind of attention? We'll be fine. In and out. No games. I'll monitor any data you send back, and I'll be here to patch anyone up, should it come to that.
Maya has a plan for this meditation session. She's going to bring her makeup kit and wait until Virgil gets into a deep trance, then go to town on him. I may have to watch. What's your excuse this time? You not get enough sleep? You need some aqua caca, huh? Ow! Just let me go! It just fell, okay? Well, I tell you! Tinsha, you stupid prick! Quit fucking up! Hey! Boss man! Make him stop! Shut it, Okaka! Carry on. I'm enjoying the show. <laughs> See, Pashanwala? Even Exo agrees. Okay, okay. For the good brother. <laughs> <laughs> We got a job, Baratnas. Listen up. Nah, fuck that. I'm tired of rooting around in the dumpster for that Inya. Cox promised us a real payday. He said, give me three months and you never have to work again. He said, he said, this the next job and he the boss man. <sighs> Just like series, bossing everyone around. Only this time, no dolls to keep you on the leash, yeah? This isn't serious. Oh. On the ship, I'm the Exo. Shit. I was only fucking with you, Copain. Come on, Baratna. So far, none of the biomass that's gone through this recycler has been a crew member. I consider Arlen is right, that Rayan can't keep his shit from breaking. It only makes my job harder. ETA, five minutes, drummer. Will do, boss man. Headed back to my room to suit up now. Where are you going to go, Kamina? Huh? Anywhere but here. With anyone but you. <laughs> Hate me all you want. You are many things, Beltaloda, but you are not a traitor. You love your belt. And right now, belt is me. I'm busy. You're late. Quit tinkering and get your helmet. We're about to push off. Fucking make me. <laughs> Typical Martian? With the mouth that only knows how to kiss ass and spew caca. <laughs> I already beat Arlen's ass today. Guess Virgil can handle one more patient. I should put you in the brig for this. You'd have to catch me first.
Cutting thrust. Prepare to enter float in three, two... <laughs> uh. Come on. Let me hear it. You got me. <laughs> Fuck yes. Finally! <laughs> <laughs> you were kicking my ass for a minute. I thought you had me again. That was a good move. <laughs> kind of a cheap shot, though. If it was a cheap shot, I would have smashed your brittle belter bones against the ceiling. Don't believe everything they taught you in the Martian Navy. My bones are just as strong as yours. I didn't believe a single thing they taught me at that fascist brainwash factory. That's why I'm here with you brittle bitches. Arlen and Rayan have begun breaching the airlock off the bridge. Once we're in, we are Holy going to- Holy shit, Io! Usually, Io is covered up by these dust streams that fire off from its poles after volcanic activity. But it's clear as day. It's hard for me to look at these moons without thinking about the Earther research colonies exploiting all the resources on them and giving nothing to the belt. That's... fucked up. <laughs> I usually only look for what could kill me out here. But it's nice getting to see it through your eyes. Even if they're the eyes of an inner who doesn't know her ass from her oxygen bulb. You mean an inner who pile-drived your ass into a ceiling, right? <laughs> <laughs> Let's head out. Just remember to- Woohoo! <sighs> As I was saying, remember to keep your weight back when you land. Still, not bad for an inner who's barely been in the belt for a month, eh? Reminds me when Rayan and I were learning to spacewalk. One time, he crashed right into the hull and shit his vac suit. <laughs> shut, shut, shut it! Cool up! Whoa! Ah, airlock is open, Exo. Uh, good. Let's see what we have in here. Table scraps. Ah! Fuck! Yo, Baratna. She's crazy.
Just breathe. Keep your head down. It's okay. Now say puke in your soup, eh? That you won't choke to death on your own sick. Enough. Whoever put out this welcome gift for us is long gone, and they left behind a big-ass ship that must have some valuables still on it. So get scavenging! You all have your orders. Hurry up and do your job so we can get back home. It's not like the pirates took down some creaky old ship. This thing was practically brand new. I've got an intact QPU here. Nice find. Oxygen, scrap metal, wiring. If we can use it or sell it, it goes in here. Pirates tore this place apart, but pirates aren't scavengers. like the crew didn't surrender their heads to the pirates without a fight. Keep an eye out for trouble while you're setting up the containment vaults. You ever cut anybody's head off, Ixo? Back when you ran with Dawes? One time, I cut a man's eyes out when he looked at me funny. <gasps> for real? Sure did. Wore them as earrings the next night. Pasheng Fong!
There must have been one hell of a battle here. Hmm. Doesn't look like a typical pirate attack to me. I agree. Maybe they were looking for something big and couldn't find it. Left the heads to try and scare off anyone else. Makes sense. Especially if they thought other people might come looking. Could be. The scuttlebutt around the Urshanabi has been pretty loud. like the officer's section is still intact. Go check it out. On it. You know the military. The brass always hoards the best shit. <laughs> Let's hope so. <laughs> Clean palladium in this recycler. Good pull, drummer. UNN officers always keep a backup water recycler for themselves. You were a UNN officer. Do you have a backup recycler for yourself? Of course not. I drink the same cloudy sludge as the rest of you. Mm-hmm. Commanders, this is Private Takabe. The pirates have asked me to report the following. All crew members, except for those barricaded in the officers' quarters, have been killed or captured. The pirates do not wish to kill anyone else. If you open the gate now and allow them to complete their search, no more lives will be lost. And if you do not comply... Oh God, please don't! Arlen and Rayan's experience hauling minerals on Vesta has been a big help, even when they annoyed the hell out of me. This map would be helpful if all the pieces were still together. No such luck. I did run a phase array scan. Everything matched the LiDAR, except for one gap in the captain's quarters. I'll check it out when I get in there. Skinnies. Bigoted asshole. He still didn't deserve to die like this. Hey, Khan. You've been flying a long time. Ever seen anything like this before? Nah. But when it comes to pirates, nothing surprises me. They're all monsters. You've seen the damage they did. What do you think they were after? Could be anything. Question is, whether they found it or not. Microwave energy gun. Not a bad choice for persuading someone to open a door.
Last time Khan smoked a cigar on the ship, Maya had to spend half the day cleaning out the air filter. Not a lot of particulates in the air filter. Virgil, how long do you think the bodies have been like this? A couple of days? That's my assumption after analyzing the footage of the heads and the remnants of the precipitating battle. What can you tell me about the heads, medically speaking? From the uniformity of the incisions, it seems clear they were done post-mortem. Very difficult to be precise if the victim is fighting back. So, about that. It's a fingerprint lock. You're going to need to find the right hand. An officer. The baka. Good news. The logs show that there was one out in the crew mess hall. Second Corporal Horowitz. All right. Might be difficult to get his body back to the door, though. Don't need all of them. Oh, God. Europa's Bane. Anyone heard of it? It's one of Toussaint Zapata's ships. Ah, fuck. Shoulda known. Who is that? Latest pirate flavor of the month. Led a mining strike on Europa. Stole a few ships. Now self-employed as a full-time murdering psychopath. UNN has been giving her a wide berth. If she wanted to take out this ship, it means she had a good reason. Or, she's just a murdering psychopath. Got it. Thanks. Maya, I'm in the mess hall. Time to find an officer. I've linked the personnel records to your terminal. Try scanning the bodies and see if you get a match. Looks like the crew tried to mount a defense here. For all the good it did. Those poor people. This is awful. Have you ever seen anything like it? No. Not even on series? Not even on series. Hashang. Check the shoulders. UNN officers have those fancy bars. I know pirates are vicious, but this is... You hear stories about people who spend too long off station. Go Bic Pagal. Bic Pagal? My belter is... It means really fucking crazy. I wonder if Toussaint was here herself, or if she stayed back on the ship like some other captains I know. Another pirate corpse. That makes two in here. Better than none. Know anything else about the Europa's Bane? Must be pretty massive to tear apart a frigate. Hell should I know. But if you learn any more about them, feel free to fill me in. This much violence seems pretty 
Big Pagal to me. Can you hurry up? Working on it. This was a massacre. No other word for it. The sooner we get out of here, the better. Have you checked the ceiling? If his mag boots were off, he might have drifted. That's the one. Poor Earther. Sorry about this. Happening. Ah, ah, an accident. My leg. Uh, it's the Flota, you're the accident. Keep holding. I'll be right there. Drummer, whatever mess he's got himself into, make sure the containment vault is secure. We cannot afford to lose it. Captain, Rayan's back suit is not now. Drummer, get your ass over there. On my way. Hold still. We'll see what we can do. What happened? Unexploded charge, I think. Pirates must have left it behind. Pashang, you didn't scan first. Drummer, his suit is punctured and losing pressure. You need to release the vault and patch him now or he could die. Play that. That vault has O2. Fuel, armaments. We can't afford to lose it. Send Virgil. No. I'm sorry, Van. We're going to have to remove the leg. Nah, nah, you're crazy! We need these supplies to survive. I wish there was another choice. What are you doing? Lowering the oxygen intake. It's no morphine, but it'll help. No, no, I can't. Be strong, Papaloza. You heard her, Baraka. Be strong. He's on his way, but Ray is stable and his suit is pressurized. Your patch should hold until he's back on board. You did good, drummer. 
Virgil's entering your sector now. Best thing you can do is hurry up and finish the search so we can get out of here. You're in. Let's see what these UNN big shots kept themselves. Captain, I'm prepping Mr. Morozov for surgery. Thanks to your steady hand, the incision is well cauterized. Will he be all right? Minimal vacuum exposure and blood loss. He's a very lucky man. Thanks, Virgil. Glad you were here. This is Christian Abasarala, Deputy Undersecretary for Peace Operations. I am denying your request for additional support against Belter hostiles. Captain, you lead a well-armed battleship against a single pirate frigate. You outnumber them five to one. I don't give half a fuck what ghost stories you have heard about this Captain Tucson. Do your fucking job. Or you can hand me your bars directly when you return to Earth to do whatever disgraced soldiers do after they have been retired. Regards, Christian Abasarala. This one didn't see any other way out. Found the captain. Well, most of him. Fucking savages. Looks like a personal key card. I should find wherever it opens. Found a key card on the captain. Not sure what it's for, though. Check his room? Maybe he has a safe somewhere that pirate scanners wouldn't have picked up. I've heard some Earthers find it therapeutic to fly with something that reminds them of life at home. Plants, soil, stuffed animal carcasses. Hey Cap, you need any dead animals for your desk? Why the fuck would I? Probably still has rabies. Come on, you're an Earther. You don't want a memento of Earth and its weird mammals? Do I seem like I miss that shit planet? I've been out here for so long I wouldn't know a ferret if it bit me on the ass. I'll just leave it here. 
Earthers like to visit the parts of their planet that they haven't destroyed yet. I'm no art snob, but I don't think most paintings are done on iron. Maybe something good on here. Or maybe a lot of dick pics. Guess we'll see. Cap, found something that could be something. Transmitting now. Fuck. That's a lot of data. <laughs> Alright. Load up the crew and head back. I'll see if there's any gold in this shit pile. Yeah, boss man. Khan's picking up a short in the fusion coupling. She needs you to take a look. Now? Is that necessary? It is, if you want to put this wreck behind us. I'm on it. Despite Khan's nickname, this cannon hasn't killed anything yet. It did break up some pretty large debris, though. This is Drummer. Preparing to access the fusion coupling. Stand by. Maya. Maya. The volcano. You have to see this. Maya? Is everything... Ah! 
come in. What the fuck is going on? Someone respond. Cox. This is the way of it. We all know that. Death is part of the pact we make when we venture into the belt. Drummer was one tough bitch. With her past, I figured she would survive anything. But none of us is immune to the realities of life out here. I know Kamina Drummer. And she wouldn't want us wasting our oxygen on mourning. She'd tell us to get off our asses and get to work. That's the drummer I know. She'd be looking ahead to the next score. The next burn. That's right, boss man. I keep my eyes forward. But that makes it a lot harder to watch my back. Go on, Cap. Tell them. What you did. How the hell did you- Zabakawala tried to torch me. Lured me down to the thrusters, hit the engine. Play it off like it was an accident. I bet he was up in the bridge alone before coming down here, yeah? So what? I was setting new coordinates. How, how was I supposed to know you were on the hull? <laughs> Why don't we pull up the radio logs from the server? Shouldn't take long. Now I understand. Y'all see what's happening? Drummer's making her move. I always wondered when she would. Why did you do it? Was there something on that drive I found? Can you believe this bullshit? You've been planning this since you first stepped on board this ship, haven't you? Mutinous bitch. Ask yourselves, who do you believe? Me? Or the man who has made promise after promise, with no payoff. Darling, Rayan. Take her down to the brig. She's gonna pay for this traitorous bullshit. Do it! Maybe... be right, Drama. You can be pretty rough on your crew sometimes. But Beltalorda ain't nothing if we sell each other out to Inyas. Nah. I don't think so, Pampa. Damn skinnies. I should have known. Everybody stay where you are. Stand back. This is still my ship. Why don't you put that gun down, Captain? We're all crew here. We may be scavengers, but we're not criminals. We follow protocol. We solve disputes with words, not violence. That's how we keep our humanity. Give me the gun, Captain. It'll be okay. She's gonna kill me. No one is gonna kill you. I won't be so sure about that. Back off. I'm warning you all. Captain, it'll be okay if you just- Bullshit. Tell it to the skinnies, not me. You want to see what happens to you when they're in charge of this ship? Maybe we should tell them who you really are. Oh my god, I'm so sorry.
be sorry later. Right now, do your job. What happened to do no harm, asshole? Are you okay? I'm good. Good. I'll man the bridge while you sort out this shit show. Just don't touch anything! I'll be right there! As soon as Dr. Dipshit here is finished. I did everything for you, drummer. I could have turned you over to Dawes a hundred times, but I didn't. Because we made a deal. Our deal is dead. Oh no. Don't you fucking dare. Don't you dare- Take him to the airlock. Oh, no! No, drummer! No, let me go! Drummer, no! Please, drummer, no! Ah! Listen, come on! Listen to me, damn it! Drummer, listen to me. The coordinates on that data drive, they're for the MK Core. You've never heard of it, that's exactly my point. Look, you were right, okay? I did try and take you out. I've heard how you ungrateful fucks all talk about me. Why should I let you cash in now? But really, I... I wanted the profits for myself. Because this score, drummer... This is the greatest score any scavenger has ever come across. How could you possibly know that? I've been at this a long time. When there's a treasure this big, I make it my business to know about it. Look, when you find what's at the other end of those coordinates, the whole system will be on your ass. You'll need me if you want any chance of unloading it. I'm a bastard, okay? I know. But I'm not crazy. Throw me in the brig. You'll be glad I'm still here when the time comes. Listen to me, damn it. Drummer, listen to me. Thank you, thank you, son. Oh! Tie him up. <sighs> what now? We've been locked. Cox forgot to hide our drive signature. Hashang, of course he did. <laughs> Captain? Captain Drummer, what are your orders? Captain Drummer, what are your orders? <laughs> <laughs> 